Hey, so this is how to make your own finance charts in Google Sheets. So here I have a spreadsheet. One cell has stocks, one has currencies. And so in an empty cell, I'm gonna type equals Google Finance, the cell I'm gonna want. In quotes, I'm gonna say price. For start date, I'm gonna say today minus a year ago, up until today, okay? So if I type in meta, that will give me the stock prices for the last year. Currencies is about the same with a slight twist. So we're gonna type instead concatenate, and we're gonna say in quotes, currency, colon, comma, the next cell over, comma, in quotes, USD. Okay, so if I type in Euro in J2, that concatenates this to be currency, Euro, USD. Okay, I'm gonna do the same exact thing here and put it over here and we're going to say for this cell it's going to be i2 and so now we have all the data for the currency so how to do the stock chart we're going to just say insert chart and shrink it down so it fits okay and then over here we're going to say line chart okay and then for the data range we can say A1 colon B, and then we're going to just check these two boxes, okay? And we're going to do the exact same thing for the currencies. And all you have to do is say right-click, data range, and change this so it says L1M, and then that gives you for the currencies. And the wonderful thing about this is you can basically change the stock symbol to whatever you want. So if you change it to Coca-Cola, it changes. If you change it to JP Morgan, it changes. And the same thing with currencies. You can change it to a Japanese yen. You can change it to even a crypto, let's say Bitcoin. And then if you want, you can even change this up. So if you want, let's say a five-year, you just make this five-year, and now you have a five-year chart for JP Morgan. So anyway, that's a quick run through how to make your own finance charts in Google Sheets.